The Elder Scrolls 5. It's been out for over 10 years now. We're still trying to find ways to make the game look as next gen as possible. Now, some more than others also try to find a way to make the game look good and also save tons of performance. But, you know, with prices and things like that going on, some people have to settle for less. And I think I'm here to help you the best way I can. Now, in the video, if you like what you see, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. We're a whole new culture going on, and I really want to get this channel up and running for the from 2021 on out. So you guys stay tuned with me, and let's get straight into the showcase. Now, the first difference that you need to make in your game is lighting. Now, we're not using an ENB, so I'm going to help you out. First things first, you need a weather mod. And the weather mod that we're using is Natural and Atmospheric Tamriel. NAT is hands down one of my favorite best weather mods out. It really makes the game balance out as far as lighting in a realistic aspect. Not really too much on the fantasy side and not too much on the grid. Just perfect for realism. And next, for lighting, I use dynamic full metric lighting and sun shadows. This mod also really makes the shadows and things in the forest and interiors look a lot more realistic. It hits exactly how it does when you step foot outside your house and look around I'm like, whoa. So the real question is, what forest mods am I using? How does my forest look? <laughs> amazing so i'm using origins of forest i'm also pairing that up with 3d plants and trees and folk vanger these three mods really will enhance your forest it will make your game look like you just looked outside the window and you just looking at your backyard it is such a great three pair of mods that i do recommend you download if you really really want this forest like look The next thing, textures. Now, if you want your game to really pop out and really isolate itself from standard vanilla and go up to a completely HD Skyrim, textures are a huge thing. So first things first, you would need SMIM static mesh improvement. You will also need Noble Skyrim, the 2K version. Do not get any 4K version mods as they will really mess up your performance in certain areas. So that is it for this video. Yes, it was pretty short and quick, but I really want my channel to be focused on that. Easy, straight to the point, get what you need, put it in your game. The next video will be focused on the NPC character creation and somewhat clothing type of aspect. So if you're ready for that, please make sure you hit that like button, make sure you comment, and please make sure you subscribe. Thank you for watching. Have a nice one.